It's 9.14 a.m. Come on, man. Well, it looks like I might end up missing that bus because well, I got to make a quick stop at the ATM. Well, I thought there was a bus stop right here. Somewhere up in here. I don't remember. But, um... So, yeah, they... I didn't get to see what the company was, but I was on the bus and it was a white man with that worked for one of those companies. And he had his elbow out the window, like the gang stalking. Come on, man. The gang stalking network, they're all like purping me really heavy and following me. You know, purping me. And look, look at him too. Blue, red, um, red shirt and blue car. Freemason and three black vehicles in a row. Like how did how do they know in advance? Like I thought of a last minute moment. I thought of a last minute moment to um like a, at the very last minute to come and walk over here. Cause I was gonna go to the other towards the other direction. So, look, he was waiting for me. And look, the bus driver is even purple with the red hat. So yeah, and it's okay for the gang stalkers to think they're better than me, but you know, as I said, they've coerced, they forced me into this situation and then expect me to be grateful for it. The religious ones want me to be grateful, you know. The religious narcissistic perps when I when they got cars like nice cars like that Cadillac. So this bus, I miss this bus, you know. Oh look, it's number six thirty-three, and certain tail lights are brighter than the other. Maybe it was meant for me to take the other bus. See, look at the death, the, the death reference. The satanic death reference. I, I get stuff like that. So, well, y'all, of course, y'all going to see this video afterwards, but at least pray for me that they don't evict me. And look at this perp. He's perping with the red shirt. <clears throat> <clears throat> so well I, I didn't get paid until today <clears throat> and that money's about to be gone so <clears throat> and she's wearing a faded red shirt or almost pink shirt And she got, uh, look, look like she got one tail, like one brake light. Every, look, she got one brake light. 
and people want to say just ignore them don't i mean ignore them and tune them out but i'm about to but i'm about to um <clears throat> well if i can ignore the um ignore the gang stalkers and miss mary's a perp then then you know well i can ignore her and stay at the fucking apartment but no i'm about to this meeting is that i'm supposed to be getting evicted So I would have to be forced to waste or spend more money to go back to the DMV if I had if they let me stay and I had to change apartments. I would have to go back to the DMV and also go to the um post office in in order to get my um my driver's license uh, my address changed on the driver's license. So this is how, how they, like they said, with their traffic and they keep moving you around when you're targeted. That they keep moving you around, they said that's the trafficking. But some professed targeted individuals encourage you to keep moving. Oh, what? I just noticed this. And, and this is the... Um, I just noticed that of all the years that I've been here in Pensacola, downtown Pensacola is Masonic and racist, Chucks. And y'all falsely call me a hypocrite. Yeah, so this is 160 West Government Street. I didn't even realize that the building is Masonic. Oh, it got Freemason symbolism. Or is it, it looks like it's new. I mean, like the, the carving looks like it's new. Cause I, all, those, all those years, I never saw that on, the, on that building. It's like they, they're infecting every, and I'm talking to my subscribers who's watching my videos, who's listening to me. I'm not talking to myself like the online perps falsely make me. I'm a crazy person just walking down the street talking to myself. It's not true.